this mass suicide victims adhere to the Mayan calendar, which predicts the end of time to occur on the 21st of December of 2012. I thought we'd have more time. In 2012, an ash cloud traveled thousands of miles all the way to Las Vegas. With Vegas, we were faced with an incredible challenge, and that was to show a destroyed Vegas, but still make it look like Vegas. Roland really wanted this concept of the Earth displacement. Now, we don't just have a few casinos that are crumbling, but we also have this huge chasm that's running like straight through the Vegas Strip. Las Vegas was very difficult because we didn't have any real backgrounds to work with. You have images of your actors in front of blue screen, so you have to create a virtual world around them and make that believable. It's really creating a painting. Okay, let's move everybody, come on! Right. Wow, that's a big plane. It's biggest plane in the world. We built our own version of the Antonov. The computer-generated model of the Antonov needs to look 100% photo real. And it's so good that it's not only usable for the wide shots, but that we can go pretty close to it. The massiveness, the scale of all this is something that I've never come across. To see that kind of process from the script to a final frame that has sound and music, that's something that I could never get tired of. It's a completely new way of looking at the glamorous Vegas. Basically, it's the digital technology which is so amazing. This gives you like a new freedom and I really use that to the max.